What's up, guys? Welcome back to another episode of Indigo Prophecy. I am your host, Cells Leader Carson. I have food in my belly. <gasps> oh, my goodness. That's the sign that you've had too much. And let's get back to the game. As we last left off, we were attacked by um, the mysterious voices, and now we are in a mysterious place. Yeah, yeah to I'm actually right. Unknown place, 104 degrees. God damn it. That's Arizona. It has to be Arizona, folks. It's the only, it's the only normal place. That makes sense. What the fudge? <sighs> there we go. Where the hell are you? Holy fudge, it is the Oracle! I've been looking forward to meeting you. Few men are capable of resisting an Oracle. What is there so different about you? Let us discover where you are hiding behind the secret. The Chroma. You have the Chroma. So that explains it. What? How did you ever acquire such a power? No matter. What matters is, the time has come for you to die. What? Um, uh, oh crap, Chroma. The Chroma? What does that mean? I'm trying to eat and, uh... created the universe. The origin of everything. It gives extraordinary powers to those who possess it. So God has the chroma? Uh, die. Why do I have to die? I pose no threat to you. The sacrifice has created a link between our souls. Each time that I look through the serpent, you see what I see. The only way to break the link is for one of us to die. Enough talk. Other matters await my attention. <laughs> we will see each other again in the other world. That's so funny. It'd be funny if. What the fudge? What's going on? The... Holy fudge! What the hell is that thing? Oh god, this is not good. Time to run! Oh god, oh god, he's gonna kill me. Oh god. Come on, run! Music's epic still. Oh god, I thought I was gonna hit it. You're not gonna take me alive. Well, if it's 104 degrees, I'm guessing it's uh, Arizona. It's the only place that's too hot. We don't get that hot. Yes, you do. 110 degrees is hot. You'll never take me alive. be like a track star for running this long. And for doing all those jukes. Oh, oh Jesus, I'm gonna die. My last wor words are money Oh, okay, never mind. <laughs> what the hell happened? Agatha, but how? Listen closely, Lucas. Those who employ the Oracle are searching for a little girl. A perfectly pure soul that's never been incarnated. Really? Her coming was foretold by the most ancient prophecy in human history. She's the one you see in your dreams. Okay. You must find her before the Oracle does and put her someplace safe. Hurry. There isn't much time and they are already back on your trail. Okay. Oh, uh, dream. Uh, monkeys, yeah, huh? Uh, uh, flashing flashbangs. I must inform you that we are unhappy. Very unhappy. He has escaped you again. First in the museum lot. I knew lot. it'd be aliens. A big mistake, the museum lot. And then in the wave. What's worse, you showed yourself openly to him. And all for nothing. It's just. I was unaware of certain factors, my lords. Which factors? He possesses the Chroma. That's impossible. Idiocy! How could he possess the Chroma? Because I'm the chosen one! But it is a certainty that he does. 
This is how he resisted my psychic attacks and successfully evaded the police. This could force us to change our plans. This is serious. Very serious. That is not all. Someone has intervened. What do you mean? While you were with him in the wave? Yes, my lord. Someone brushed aside all of my attacks on Kane and protected him. It was not one of ours. Certainly not. Not no. indeed. I think it was something else. Its chroma was... different. Ha. Another clan? That's impossible. Only we are left. We have a rival. Who Ooh. searches for the Indigo child as we do. They must not find the child. That would be a catastrophe. A disaster. Cain is on their side. Unless they are just using him. He is the key. He sees through our eyes. He must not find the child. You must deal with this problem. Definitely. Who are these people? First off, I have already taken measures. He will be. They look like giant aliens, for all I know. And soon. Do not disappoint us. Indeed. You may leave us. Yes. Your president commands you from the United States. I bet you it's all the world leaders around the, our world. Negative 60 degree. Sleazy hotel. Nice. Uh-oh. The Oracle is in Marcus's church. There's not a moment to lose. I've got to warn him or he's dead. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. We should wait, Carla. Backup will be here any minute now. No way. This time I'm gonna get him. The desk guy swore to us that he was in his room, and he's not gonna get away. I hope that guy didn't screw up when he said he recognized Kane's photo from the papers. He looked so blind he wouldn't recognize his own mother in a phone booth. Huh. We'll find the answer in room 369. Uh-oh. Get up, get up, get up! Ugh, my eyes are itchy though. Gotta warn Marcus somehow. Phone. Marcus, pick up. Oh, yes, in a phone call. Alright, oh, thank God, all right. Hello, my son. Uh, telephone. I'll be with you in just a minute. I just need to answer the telephone. Move! St. Paul's Cathedral. Marcus, he's in the church. Don't let him get anywhere near you. Lucas? Is that you, Lucas? What's going on? Uh, explain. I see through the eyes of the Oracle. I saw him go in your church. I know he's in there now. Oh, God. But what could he want in here? Oh, fudge, fudge, fudge. Sorry, I can't do that. That was the wrong thing to do. All right, um, I'm not going to... Uh, I'm going to pause the video. I'm going to restart that. Sorry, I was... I accidentally chose explain. I was chose to. I was trying to choose no, don't ex no time or no explain. Sorry, I apologize. This was not supposed to happen. I'll I'll restart it soon. Okay, there we go. Sorry about that. I do apologize, folks. Like I said, I was trying to choose no time or no explain or whatever it's called. We'll see what happens. If I make the wrong the same mistake again, I'm just gonna stick with it. That's a promise. Okay, so let's do this. All right, here's the phone. St. Paul's Cathedral. Marcus, <laughs> he's in the church. You know, Don't I just noticed this now. You. I'm looking at that picture with the guy Lucas? with the goatee. Is that you, Lucas? What's going on? Uh, no time. There it is. I don't have time to explain, Marcus. Run, right now. Shut the doors and lock them tight. I'm begging you, just, just do what I say. Oh, come now, Lucas. Just do it, now! Alright, well, I'm gonna lock the door. Whew. All right, I'm locked in. Now, can you explain what's Woo! going on? We did Call it! Call the police, and don't come out until they get there. Lucas? Lucas! Lucas, you're, I'm your brother! Answer me! Six, nine. Here it is. Oh, God. Freeze! Nobody go! Oh God. Either he's gone through some changes since the photo, or this is not <laughs> him. Well, what a kinky Shit. room! What the hell happened? Calm down, girl. 
I think there's been a slight misunderstanding. Tyler, it was the wrong room! Oh, God. Huh? There must be another room 369 down the hall somewhere. Um, oh, I see it. It's the wrong room number. Here it is. I think the bird has flown the coop. I'm gonna find him, Tyler. I promise you. Come on, let's go. Woo, that was close. What the hell? He's Spider-Man! Spider-Man, Spider-Man. Lucas Kane is a Spider-Man. Uh-oh. Who's calling me? Hello, monkey balls. Oh god. You must realize now that I am not joking. So please, don't delay. Oh god damn it! Mother fudger! You got my girlfriend, and she's hot too. But I have these delicious fries. I'm moving towards my death. Everything that I've been through since the second I entered that diner, all of it was leading me to this moment. I was tired of fighting, running, and hiding all the time. I, I hear you. I was man. losing anyway. There was only one thing left to do. Go Try on. to save Tiffany's life. After that, I decided not to fight my destiny anymore. Okay. Lucas! Lucas, help me! Under that bird, I guess. Tiffany, she's at the top of the roller coaster. I have to find a way up there. That's weird. I get the feeling I've seen that guy somewhere before. All right, I'm coming, bird. There it is. I'm coming, Tiffany. Hold on. There's also a car there. Just give me a minute. Come on, Jeff! Hold on, baby! I'm, I'm running over here! Just give me a minute! Just, just give me a minute! Okay, okay, I gotta turn the power on, I guess. There we go! Whoa, what the fudge? Damn bird. Come on, Jeff! Hold on! Whew. Got a rat roller coaster, I guess? This is a little awkward. Well, at least I didn't think it would. He would. It, I would reduce myself to this. Okay, um, well, safety first. Safety first, always. I had a dream that I actually fell off a roller coaster because I didn't have the bar on. Imagine that, folks. Alright. Go away, Lucas. It's a trap. They're going to kill you. But I'm going to try and save you, at least. I have to! For the better of my love! Uh oh. Oh god. Easy, easy! Easy, easy! Easy, easy, easy! Okay, easy! Ow! I'd rather be playing slender than this. Oh god. Go. No, yes, no, 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 yes, no. Yes, no. Okay, there we go. Oh god, no, no, no. And, oh god. This is tough. I want to keep the balance. I'm almost there. I'm almost there. Woo. Woo. That was close. I'm gonna save you, Tiff. Hang on that pipe. Stay still. I got you, babe. Come here. You okay? Enjoy your ride to the other world. No! What are you doing? Uh, what's going on? Uh, 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 grab my hand! Wrecked. Oh my.
my god. Um, I don't know what to choose, so... One... Wait, wait, wait. Gotta do my count. Okay. One, two, three... Stop. Now. The Oracle it is! Okay, it was working like that. Okay, just like that. He is dead, my lords. Good. Very good. Now you must find the Indigo Child as soon as possible. There isn't much time. The visions are becoming clearer and clearer. I've nearly got her position localized. Move quickly. Time is short. Yes. The child must not escape us. The prophecy must be fulfilled. What prophecy? You may leave us. The prophecy that's, uh, we, you find the child, did you see the coming of a whatever, Majiga? That's it. It's over. Now there's nothing to do but wait, though it shouldn't be long. Perfect. All has gone according to plan. What the fudge? I sense another signal. Cerebral spinal activity. I think he's dreaming. What the hell is going on here? I. What is this? Wake up, Marcus. It's time. Yes, it's time. Hurry up. We don't have much time. Are you sure you want to go, Lucas? It could be dangerous. We have to go in there ready for anything, Marcus, right? Maybe there'll be an alien spaceship inside, or the tomb of an ancient king, and huh. all of his treasure. Or a giant frozen dinosaur? And what if it's a secret weapon to take over the world? Come on, let's hurry. The hangar's gonna be well guarded. We better get going if we don't want Mom and Dad to catch us. Yes, let's go. Oh, yeah. I'm a, I'm a little boy. I'm also a ninja in disguise. Here we go. Avoid the lights at all cost. Wait, is that thing coming towards me? Oh, I was like, oh god, I'm gonna die. Holy fudge, I thought that light was going to spot me. Go. You don't see anything. You don't see anything. Whew. <sighs> We're like little ninjas. We must transverse through this. I think we can do the soldier. Quick, let's hide. Uh, run, 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 run! Come on, come on, brother! Oi! Yo, oh, whoa, that was close. I was thought I was gonna get caught. Those lights are really gonna catch me. I feel I have that feeling in the arm. Go. We can't go any further. That soldier's blocking the way. One of us should sneak around the back and find a way to avoid him. Okay. We can do this. He's like, huh? What the fudge was that? Check that sound out. Let's go, 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 Na 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 Ninja time is very awesome. I 
loving my ninja time, ninja time, ninja, ninja, ninja time. Now what? The only way to get to the hangar without being seen is to climb up the telephone pole and hang off of the cable. Impossible. That pole is right under the guard's nose. I know, but there's no other way. Listen, I'm gonna try to get him to look the other way. Meanwhile, you run okay. and climb up the pole. What? I'll try to set it up so you have enough time. Okay, but how are you gonna get in? I'll meet you back at the house. You tell me everything when you get back. Ugh. At least that way we'll know for sure whether there's a flying saucer in that hangar. Okay, okay. You're making a great sacrifice, Marcus, but I gotta cut the video off right here, sadly. So thank you very much for watching. Tune in the next and see what happens so we can find out what's in the hangar. So bye-bye.